Hello guys, today I am going to show you how to make a dice in 3ds Max. This tutorial is for the beginners who are just starting to learn what is 3ds Max all about. I am not going to use any advanced techniques and I will be showing you the easy way of doing this. Ok let's start now, follow my steps. Let's create a box for the dice, all W for entering the perspective views. Now I am giving the box the shape of a cube, so 45, 45 and again 45. That's a cube now, let me make it editable poly and editable poly ok now select polygon now choose the sides of the cube and then search for inset ok and let's make it 3 or 4 maybe uh, I think 3 will be better Now select the other two sides and now insert again 3 yes and now the other two sides the last two sides ok now come to the front, uh, front view and now select the edges and connect them and do the same for the vertical edges too Come to, the, come to the top view and connect the edges now this is important now come to the come to perspective view and then search for uh, subdivision surface in the uh, menu box search for subdivision surface and uh, deselect isolin display and select you uh, select use norms subdivision now you can see that this is a kind of a smooth surface and it gives the shape of a dice and now editable poly now choose vert, uh, vertices okay now let's make the dots now in the front view select six uh, six vertices to make them uh, like a dots in the dice and now make them cham uh, chamfer give it an amount of 3 uh, maybe uh, I think th 3 will be fine ok that's good now come to uh, uh, come to the right view and now we are uh, select 5 vertices and now chamfer again 3 amount yeah now again come to the back view now select a single the vertex and now chamfer now come to the left view and select uh, around 4 4 vertices yeah ok that's good and chamfer I think 2 will be better yeah uh, 2 vertices ok and now let's go to the uh, top view yeah, select it and top view T for top view and uh, now I can select 4 here yeah, 4 vertices and chamfer give it 3 ok and now let me come to the bottom view now I'll select 3 vertices ok uh, ok we are, give, uh, we are given the polygons for the dots and uh, now we can come to the perspective view and select all the polygons we have created yeah ok Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to I'm going to bevel them so that uh, they can form a uh, dot uh, dot in the dice. Yeah, bevel. You can be uh, bevel them as you wish, any amount. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Now we have the dots in the dice, and now we can give them color. ok 
okay now give white to the entire dice you can change them as you wish but I'm giving it white okay now choose the polygons choose every polygons and you can see that only the uh, middle polygon is chosen now to, uh, now to choose the other polygons the outer polygons just give grow uh, give to selection in polygon menu and grow now as you can see uh, the other polygons are selected too around the middle polygon and uh, now give them any color as you wish I'm giving it red okay yeah. now it's time to make it a uh, lot smoother so I'm giving it turbo smooth type T and you can search for turbo smooth now you can see that it's almost like a dice and uh, if you give more uh, texturing it will be more perfect but no, for now it's uh, a good model 